right, so visual record of the JET JS300. It's got the JS400 uh, pick guard on it. There are um, two Mojo Tone 58 quiet coils in the neck in the middle, an Artec Giovanni Vintage Humbucker 2 which is an Alnico 3 humbucker that's at about, I'd say 8.8, 8.9, which is uh, split two Borns Push Push uh, 500K pots. Uh, 500K as recommended by Mojo Tone. If you can see, eh. I don't know. You can see it, it's tucked underneath the uh, yellow tone cap. There's a 470 pico farad treble bleed also as recommended by Mojo Tone. No 2-2 cap. That is a um, four-pole super switch. This would work um, with a two-pole super switch the way that it's wired right now. There's super switches in there. You can wire it any way you want to. This is the coil split for the humpucker. And when the knob is in the down position, it is split. It's a partial PRS style split. So I think it's split on the slugs. I, I, I don't recall. Anyway... This is the, uh, kind of like the Gilmore switch, except it only works in position one. So you get uh, the full neck pickup, since there's only two pots on this thing. What else can I tell you? It's a pure tone jack, highwood saddles. This is the original uh, bridge plate, which is a uh, Wilkinson M series. It's got a full steel block and uh, five exotic raw vintage vintage tension springs. Exotic X-O-T-I-C. Like the pedal maker. So there you go. Um, these are noiseless the way that they are built. They're, they're basically their sidewinders. They're built like a Firebird pickups. They sound pretty sweet. Black covers, uh, no cover with black bobbins on the humbucker. I'll make a video of the thing put back together. Poplar body. It's actually pretty cool.